this is the Saturday wrap for Saturday the 20th of April 2023 and if you listen to certain podcasts for 20 day etc I am today trying this in natural light although with the curtains semi-closed um, to save the world and um, I'm a bit lazy anyway this is me looking back on the previous week the weather the politics the tech the planting the more planting and um yeah voting who knew anyway so let's have a look at the week the week was planting okay i'm stealing all this from further on but um uh, yeah lemon basil uh, red spring onions uh, radishes strawberry plants um more spring onions the red ones etc 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 um and some earthing up of some potatoes i was going to do some potatoes today but um nah. anyway planting 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 we really should be into proper spring um the rain has sort of mostly stopped for a while um and it is quite warm and sunny but overnight especially thursday it got really frosty and tonight is going to be down to three degrees celsius the days are going to be warm but the nights are cold uh, not particularly good anyway so the app of the week and i have mentioned this before um but it's a freebie and it's a freebie on ios ipad os and mac os it is keynote it is superior to powerpoint um and with both of them you can create intros uh, animated intros you just do a animated presentation and save it out as an mp4 which i really need to have a go at because i haven't done that for I think the last time I did it was a craft ale pub bar upstairs in Womanby Street. They were happy days. Anyway, um, so that's um, Keynote. Uh, the thing of the week, well, if you've got a Pixel phone and you swipe to the left, uh, it pulls up articles. And one of those articles was about little chefs. I didn't realise they had completely gone. I think the last time I was in one was... I was on the way down to um, Portsmouth and it was when the iPad first came out and I stopped off early in the morning about seven o'clock and I filled my face and it was quite good. Before that, um, somewhere near Duxford, stayed in a travel lodge overnight. Next door was a little chef and I had a cafeteria of coffee along with my full English. But they're gone um so nowadays is find the nearest supermarket off the motorway and fill up that's a shame but things do actually change right the song of the week um time and the place now i can't remember this this is 79 or 81 but it does remind me of exams so it could either be o levels or a levels it's a canadian band with two ladies called martha martha and the muffins echo beach i think it really was their only hit single um there are lots of versions of it on youtube and it still brings back i don't know about happy memories because exams are never happy but time and a place one of them was a weightlifter i believe there you go anyway let's start with saturday um i was in the john wallace linton um i couldn't get my normal seat uh the bus was late because it went round the world and all that sort of stuff so i was right at the very back and um i think it was the ship manager came up to me with a glass with some beer in it and said they took that off last night i put it back on i think it tastes all right do you think it tastes all right had the beer before it's adequate no great shakes but the the taster was fine and she left the glass with me so um i finished it off so i am now the official semi-official beer taster of the john wallace linton weather spoons in newport it's good to have an official title anyway sunday i had a little crack at timu 
Uh, I didn't know that you had to spend at least fifteen pounds. Uh, I needed some plumbing glue, sticky stuff because I got a leak downstairs in the sink. Um, and that was do it cheap. Um, and I bought three other things which I can't remember what they are, and they seem to be delayed at the moment. But I keep getting something from Timu saying, "Oh, we're sorry about this. Have these on sale?" Which I think possibly is an indication they want me to buy more. But uh, deliver the first stuff first, please. Um, was it shop like a billionaire? Uh, get delivered like a billionaire, perhaps. Also on Sunday, lemon basil and red spring onions. Uh, I used, if you saw this the week before, the John Innes potting compost that I had from Amazon. It's really good stuff. I have, and I'm looking at them, plastic bags over them at the moment to create the microclimate. I'm keeping them well watered. Uh, I think it's 14 to 21 days before the spring onions come up. We shall see. Monday came home. Strawberry plants had arrived. I got 80 litres of compost from Aldi, the seaweed and hunt stuff, and I planted them all out. And uh, I was a bit worried on Thursday morning because of the frost, but they seem to be okay, so I'm keeping them well, well watered. Um, and I'm going to feed them before long as well. Uh, also, Tuesday, radishes. <laughs> um, radishes Wednesday was an emergency Beano Wednesday I was back in Newport um, buses uh, I thought they'd moved the timetable around instead they cancelled one bus and when I went for it it wasn't there but the one before it was very late so I got in um, quite a, early and I found that I had £4.50 on my Starbucks app so for the first time since 2018, I was in Starbucks in Newport having a venti latte, which was very nice, and uh, leeching off their Wi-Fi. I spent all day out. I uh, ended up in the lamb with their Wi-Fi watching videos of Canadian bands. I was a bit sleepy, to be perfectly honest. Uh, Thursday, as I said, frosty unpleasantly frosty uh thursday night a more red spring onions planting and today i'm doing my postal vote for the local police and crime commissioner i'm not altogether sure what they do i'm not altogether sure if they're worth it um but i'm gonna vote anyway so uh, that was my week um planting weather Ooh, not a great deal of tech um, but, you know, sometimes weeks are like that. Oh, fantasy football. Um, I fell to ninth. I think I'm back up to eighth. Um, I'm a bit rubbish. Hats off to Tyrone, who is still top. Anyway, how are we looking? I think it's time to go. Um, thank you, and uh, the usual comments, please.